So we first met the sellers back in 2019 when they were looking at selling her father's house. We took that to auction and got a great result. So over the next five years from that point, we ended up selling five other homes for the same family. So the biggest question anyone has when they're selling their house is trying to decide what they buy next. Well, the biggest question is how much am I gonna get for mine? So we offered to take a few buyers through the home just off our database without advertising it and spending any money. So we had eight buyers come and have a look at the home and uh, got some good feedback from qualified buyers about what they think it would sell for if we took it to market. And that allowed the owners to then go out and shop with a budget. Dylan mentioned eight buyers going through and to some people that might, might not sound like a lot, but we, uh, as a team, we'll work together and finding qualified buyers. There's a bit of work that goes in behind the scenes in terms of um, budget, what people are looking for, the area, the schools that they're looking for. We filter down to those eight qualified buyers that went through the home. So the vendor's got a really good gauge of what the home was worth um, from buyers that are looking for that particular home in the area. We decided to take some photos before Christmas uh, and launch over the Christmas period because we know that lots of buyers are looking at that plenty of time, there's not a lot of other homes on the market. So I put it online on the 27th of December and had our first open in the first week of January. Uh, so we did a full marketing campaign, brochures, board, a, a premiere video. So we had well over 100 people come and have a look at the home over that four week period. Uh, we had five possible bidders on auction day. We had two people end up bidding. Yeah, they were relieved, probably more than anything. Um, I think the excitement comes later. But they were very relieved. They've been wanting to get into something smaller and easier to manage for a long time. And this now means that they can comfortably. And they can now, because of the result, basically buy whatever they really fall in love with. Money won't be an issue anymore. Working the campaign with Dylan and, and particularly on auction day, our best buyer bought on the morning of auction day, which puts a lot of pressure on the vendors and the agents. But I think what's great about our team is that we work really well together. Um, we had a team uh, throughout the crowd and working with the bidders. Um, the bidding wasn't free-flowing, it was quite a stop-start. Buyers that were, were bidding on the day were um, hesitant and it's that type of market. So um, very easy for a, a campaign to, to do well when the market's hot, but when the market um, is more of a steady market, which, which we're in, there's a lot more work that goes in behind the scenes. And Dylan did a fantastic job of creating momentum throughout that auction and, and getting a fantastic result.